work is a great place to be. Obviously, as a young person, I feel like personally, there isn't a better city to be living in. There isn't a more exciting city to be living in. We do live all the way up near the Columbia University Medical Campus, which is quite far from downtown. But even so, there's a pretty diverse neighborhood around here and even some great places to eat. Living in New York City is amazing, especially if you're a foodie. There's so many places to go eat. If you just love diverse food, there's always something new to try. And on the weekends, I personally really like going downtown with a couple of my classmates and going to museums or even just walking around our favorite neighborhoods is always lots of fun. The community at Columbia University is great, especially the graduate student organization, which uh, I've been a part of for over a year now. They really make students feel at home and create a real sense of community by organizing several uh, socially distanced events um, in the past year, of course, that still helped everyone feel connected even in the middle of a pandemic. There's a lot of other um, organizations as well, like Women in Science Club and um, diversity organizations and book clubs and things that you can be part of where, you know, even if you're by yourself at home, you still feel like part of the Columbia community. It's really nice that Columbia makes an effort to make sure that you have a good support system. The Graduate Student Organization also has plenty of events outdoors, several hiking trips, ice skating at Bryant Park, which is one of my favorites. We had picnics in Central Park. The Women in Science Club also had picnics in J Hood Park, which is just a couple minutes from campus. And so all these events have actually been super helpful. I've met a lot of people from different programs. Some of my closest friends are in the microbiology department or the genetics department, even though I don't really have classes with them. I came to Columbia to really focus on cardiovascular research. Translating my research is actually very important to me because we're in biomedical sciences. And if we don't translate our research, then that's not of use to a lot of patients. And when I was doing my research in some of these PIs, such as Dr. Alan Tall, I noticed that he was able to run really focused clinical trials here at Columbia and abroad and was able to publish these studies in very prominent journals. And when I discovered that Dr. Riley became the head of the Center for Translating a lot of our research, like I knew that this was the place for me. What we do is we basically translate genomic findings of cardiovascular risks into validating what they do. Even though we're all under the metabolic biology umbrella, I feel like there's a pretty large range of uh, research areas that you can delve into while you're here. And during your first year, you have the chance to rotate in any of these labs and you have a lot of choices. There are so many different areas of research here that I felt that I was able to combine both of my interests. Um, for example, there's the Med-Institute grad program, which allows you to um, shadow doctors and see that uh, translational relevance of the research, which is something that I really want to um, explore as a uh, previous public health um, major. Just through my rotation so far, I've been able to explore topics that I haven't been exposed to before. In terms of the mentorship, I've had a really good experience being in a lab with a young female mentor, which um, I, was really important for me. The IHN also provides opportunity for mentorship from other students. Once you've gone to your second year or third year, or become a more senior grad student, you can participate as a mentor as well and give back. Professors who are able to run these clinical trials, they, they may seem very like senior and up there. For a lot of people, they're intimidating to approach, but all these individuals run multiple seminars where they welcome graduate students to present their work and they'll give you very concrete feedback. They're very accessible to graduate students. They're really focused on the basic research and educating. Mm -hmm.